David, your father is really sick. He brought me over here today to talk to you about his will. Your father left everything to Stacy. I think I'm gonna get a bottle. How cool would that be? There's a provision that states all assets will hereby be left to David S. Rosenberg if he is married prior to her death. Emily, I've been doing a lot of thinking, and I think we should get married today. Okay, bye. You asked me to marry you on my voicemail. I suppose I should be happy you didn't text it to me. Oh, you know I don't know how to text. You've been seeing Emily for how many years? Huh? It's a while, Dad. She's just... the one. It's coming from a man who's been married five times. Six. Each one better than the last. I can't do this anymore. Oh, Emily, please. That's it? You're just going to give up? What am I supposed to do? It's not like I have a, a pack of women breaking down my door to get married. Do you want to post an ad to find me a wife on the World Wide Web? You're not looking for the love of your life. You're looking for someone who will marry you today. Write me back and let me know where you want to do this. Love your wife. She sounds crazy. Pass. I am from Russia. My visa is going to expire in three months. I'd very much like to get married with you. Please pick me. I will keep you happy. You see, now, that one actually sounds pretty good. You can do this. You're David? I'm David. No wonder you didn't put a picture in your post. My psychic told me that I was going to meet the man of my dreams today. Oh, oh boy. You know, maybe I should call Emily. No amount of money will ever make me as happy as I felt when I was with her. You're just going to walk away? from hundreds of millions of dollars for a girl? David, I hope you get your girl back.